playing on Robertson inside the Melbourne Ford 50. Sylvia got it from Jones. The chase was good. Sylvia just gets the kick. Two on one needs. Won't win that contest. White. Dangerous knock because Betts was running onto it. Favola. What can the big man do from here? Lays it off. Fisher looked to be out of bounds. Shades of the grand final against Collingwood. But Judd, how did he mark that? Mark. And it's a soda for Judd directly in front. Carlton get the first goal of the afternoon. Well, Cruz is going to get it back from Scotland. And bangs it long. Favola and Carroll. Favola too strong, too good. Behind him here. The sun is shining. And so are the stars for Carlton. Judd and Favola with a goal apiece. Long, it's going to play into Rivers' hands. Here it is. Here's the long bomb. Sylvia came deep with the punch. Somehow Favola rose it. Around the corner. He's got two already. Back through the middle. Grigg. Sharing with Scotland. Went straight past McLean. Bentick linking up Murphy. He started the movement. Into the pocket. Gosh. Strong mark. Stood his ground. Fisher. And that's superb play by Carl. Bartram. Looking for Robertson, he stands and jumps, but the spoil came from Jamison again. Cruiser wins the knock. Judd and McLean, the two fives. In battle today, Hadley got rid of Jones, gave it to Cruiser. Clock ticks down, but Carlton go forward. O'Halpin, he's got it. Oh, did well. He's got a bit run down. Too long, play up. Carlton still working. Pfeiffer in there, wrapped, wrapped up too high. That's the run of play for the Blues. He'll tie the score up again. Makes no mistake. But a passion involved in this game now. Boys, there was a 50 every day of the week. And plenty of play. push and shove now. And the game could go up a notch, we feel. And who better to have it in his hands than the John Man? He's a genius. Super player, Chris Judd. We know he's a star. He's kicked two goals, ten disposals. Centre clearance is important, but when you score goals from centre clearances, the run and the carry, not a lot Brock McLean could do there other than maybe get goal side, an open forward line. But again, that 50. Anyway, Carlton have gone forward. Two on one for Melbourne. O'Halpin stays down for Volas there. Carroll, but it's Judd oh, who gives it to O'Halpin. Who kicks the goal? He's everywhere, Judd. The way that free kick to Nick Stevens in the middle as well for a high tackle. Not that there was much in it. Three in a row to the Blues. Hadley trying to make it four. Favola the target. No whistle on the play. Oh, well done, Cruiser. Favola yeah. wants to go on with it. It's coming back to Cruiser. Gee, he did that well, the big fella. Goals on his debut a couple of weeks ago. Can he build on that total of two, make it three? He sneaks it in. Carlton have four in a row and a lead of three goals. Just not sure where to go. Trying to draw Eddie Betts. He won't have nothing of it, Eddie. That deserves a free kick. Well done. Well, he's running a shepherd. From Simpson's usually a very good kick. Judd had to go back. Sylvia could have cleaned him up. Fisher back to Judd. Hooking to the goal square. Sun in the okay. eyes. Free kick for Vola. Now he'll go back and line up for Vola for number three. He made hard work of it, but Carlton get their fifth in a row. Worrying stage for Melbourne. Carlton winning the clearances, 17 to 9. And they're at it again here, Danny. Cruiser and Murphy with a 1-2. He's shot. tied up against the boundary. Shot. He's got pace. Off the outside of the boot, it's a belter of a goal. Another one for Carlton. Murphy's first. Joining in the party, these youngsters are relishing the opportunity to play with a superstar. Here he is, extracting it oh, from McLean and giving it to Russ. And behind the play, probably not a bad result for Carlton. Jones breaks away now for Melbourne. Again, a good chase from Favola. He's still in the contest here, Favola, if he keeps going. He may end up with a footy, and he does. Great effort. Murphy to Betts. It's got to be quick. To Cloak. They're lined up deep. He hits it long. Fisher waits. 
and marks. Well done, Tavala. Well done, Carlton. He's very hard to out to spoil against. Former Essendon player copping. Fisher kicks the goal. 37 point margin. And he hits it long into the pocket. Robertson in front of Jamison. The spoil affected nicely by the Carlton defender. But he's got it back, Brock McLean. From 55, he hits it long. Robertson goes back. Oh, good work, Jamison. Frawley, two on one. Robertson's got the big jump again. He couldn't take it. The quarter, neither side has kicked a goal. Judd's lurking. And he lurks successfully. Into the skip. He's about to kick the first and second half. Favola goes down just over the mark. Judd doesn't care. He's kicked his third and it's still going on. Well, Favola uh, and five Melbourne players around him. Satan comes in. Bama Maloney. Brett Maloney. Looks a bit of a scrap. It's, it's Maloney he's trying to get to, isn't it? Well, if you're, if you're ever going to have a blue... That was a free kick here now. Probably... The best time to have a blue is when your teammates already kicked the goal. They can't take it off you. There's a... Well, Whelan's in the book. On the scoreboard. Two in a row now for Carlton. And isn't it very sweet for their fans? McLean, look away, handball. Missed Davy is the target, but... He's too slow and away go Carlton on the rebound. Stevens can keep going here, can go all the way. Spots a man in the middle, it's Pfeiffer, got him right on the 50. Nation there between Fisher and Hadley. Fisher calls Hadley out and then passes over the top, but Hadley decides to wait. There's the mark from Cloak. Very strong grab. He's been pretty good for him this year, Cameron Cloak. Now he's had some serious shoulder problems. Well, it's super, super important. He does a lot of the bullying work. Young Cruz is still finding his way in the body stake, so Cameron Clark wants to do a lot of the bullying. What about the step then? And the pass isn't bad either, Liam, as Judd finds Favola. No, that step then was as good as I've seen. I'm 50 metres. That was at pass. Five for Favola. Kick was to Bartram. He kicks it high. Wait the spoil. Cruiser wanted Favola. Here's Frawley. Favola kept going off the ground. He, oh, he's got six. Half a dozen. And that's his best. Jamison gave it to Wait. And now Jordan Russell kept going. And a couple of the Blues players haven't given up yet. They want one more. But Favola wants another opportunity. Judd's on the, on the lead. Half volley. He's equal to it. This is Joe. He gets the last possession, or does he? No, it's on the chest of Favola. Siren has sounded. He has not missed today. He's kicked six, as Danny mentioned. He's coming off eight and seven. It will be just like this man to kick this after the siren. And it's the Judd and Favola show. All day, they've been the different size two boys. I think there'll be some genuine celebrating if uh, Favola can nail this from the boundary. Yep, Carlton <laughs> supporters standing here expecting their favourite forward to bang through number seven. He's the perfect man for this situation. Let's follow him. <laughs> You'd better believe it. Seven straight. It's a revolution. There's no other player in the competition that would have started that. Whether there be some gusto, let's find out.